hello guys welcome to my channel welcome 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 today we are cooking pilau 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 and um i'll start with boiling my meat this is a i'm boiling my meat then later i will add i have some leftovers there in the fourth end i had some leftovers of another stew meat stew so i'll just mix them as we go on and on and i cook my sweet sweet pilau so come with me as i start cooking and i hope you'll enjoy and i hope maybe you learn something if you don't know how to cook pilau all i hope you'll educate me with something or you'll correct me with something because we have so many ways of cooking so my meat is boiled i've kept it aside i'll use the same same sufuria to fry my onions until they turn brown 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 so i will start with um fry my onions and i'll let them fry and let them cook for a while until they turn brown so this is the meat which i'm going to use i did buy much because i ate some leftovers so it is not much. This is my ginger and my turmeric. I'm just smashing them. Oh, what do we call it? I just grind them, smash them until they are soft. They are very fine. And then I continue stirring, stir and stir my onions, frying until they turn the color I want it to. They must be brown. They must be well cooked. If you want your pilau to get some beautiful color that brownish color they must the onions must be brown so this is my meat i'm uh, still going to mix it with my onions because they are already cooked and then i will stir and stir and stir until they are cooked so that is my meat i'll just have to uh dip, to fry it first with the onions so that it be brown in color sorry i've just my plate has fallen down and i want the meat also to turn uh color may, maybe brownish in color so that i will add the other stew left over and it will be amazing i promise you it will be amazing so i let it uh, cook for a while and this is my other mixed spices i just add some flavor and my beef I'll also add um, beef to add some flavor and then my turmeric and ginger and everything will be okay. And my garlic also. I'm, I love adding to things. I love them because they are very natural. They have no chemicals. They have nothing. So do that is my turmeric and ginger and and uh garlic so i've already it, it's it's already turning by the way the meat is turning brown because you can see so i've added my spices just to add the flavor to the meat and that's it that's it that's it um i let it cook for a while then i'll add the other leftover stew and i promise you it will turn out amazing you love it and it would be very it came out well by the way it came out well so the meat is still cooking slowly by slowly um those are my spices i'm still adding more and more a little bit of turmeric and everything these are the powder ones the powder ones because they also have uh, other ingredients which i don't know just the natural ones so i always make sure i use that also because there is this i don't know what we call it what do they call it in the they also call it karafu is it karafu something yeah they are those swahili they are mixed with those swahili um spices the ones some if i even don't know so i like adding that powdery flavor for this why just to that is the other nini that is the other leftover meat 
the ones we had uh, left, we, we had that, that one had been left uh, during lunch time. We didn't finish, so I said, why not mix just with this? It would be very okay. It would be very okay because it just meets like the other with a little soup and everything. And it will turn out well. It will turn out well. So in my pilau, I will not use tomato sauce, but I will use tomatoes. And everything will be okay. I didn't have tomato sauce, so I didn't want to stress myself because I know it will come out right. So I used uh, tomatoes, but I made sure I cooked them until they are well, 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 well cooked. They were very cooked. Actually, I cooked them until you couldn't see any of them. And I knew it will come out still okay. And um, so that's my tomatoes. I'll wait until they have cooked thoroughly, completely. Everything will be cooked. So that's it. Can, can you see? It is already cooked. There's no tomato left to see. I made sure I smashed and everything cooked. Everything is blending well. And this, the soup is turning brown and thick. Just enough for my pilau. So that's my hot water. I'm going to add my hot water. I've boiled some water so that it won't take long. For me to wait until it boils no i've boiled some water kept it aside so i've added the water added my rice as you can see so i'm adding my rice to the water and i'll wait it it will boil yeah it will boil it will boil and let's wait and see the results the results of my rice and so that's me adding my rice to my boiling water just to see the outcome and then I'll wait for it to mix thoroughly to blend to boil and let's see the color the color it will turn so that's my salt for seasoning yeah I'm seasoning it with salt and some cubes, Reiko cubes, beef, as usual. So the beef will add more flavor to the pilau. And I like it that way. I really, I really, I never miss to put some cubes in my stew, in my greens. And they make a very good taste. They make a very good taste. So after mixing everything, I'll just cover the sufria and wait for everything to simmer to boil, to mix, and yeah, so come with me as we wait for my rice to be ready, and that's it, it's almost, it's almost, it's almost, only some few minutes left, and my pilau will be ready, so that's how we cook here in African pilau, I didn't say jollof, I don't know, but I think it's almost the same with jollof, I don't know, but that's my pilau. It's ready. It's ready, guys. Just look at it. It's ready. It's ready. Doesn't it look amazing? The color. I told you, you must make onions turn brown. Now, that's what the color the onions give to your food if you wait until they cook. They are cooked well enough. It turns into a brown, brown, beautiful color. That's my pilau. And I'm so happy it turned out the way I wanted it to turn. Yeah. You can see it's not that it's one one. That's what we call it. It's just turn it's one 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 everything. So that's my food. As you can see, my meat, my pilau, and the colour, the brown colour, that brown colour, you know. That brown colour gives it a taste appetite and Everything, it was so amazing. It was so nice. And that's how my outcome of my pilau. My pilau came out just fine. Just fine. So thank you for watching my video. Thank you for enjoying my video. I hope you enjoyed. And maybe you can tell me some advice there. Because we cook differently. Everyone has a way of cooking. That's mine. And 
you can advise me as well and please don't forget to thumbs put thumbs up on that video like comment and share please and don't forget to subscribe 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 please to my video and i'll be so happy thank you for watching thank you for watching so i'll start continue i start enjoying my rice please just let me enjoy my rice because that's my pilau and it looks so appetizing and really enjoyed it i enjoyed my cooking and i felt so good guys thank you thank you thank you ciao 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 to such a good time please subscribe like and comment bye